Hi everyone, I'm Walt Gray, and here's what's happening. The federal government could shut down this Friday if Congress and the president cannot come to an agreement on a spending bill. If it does happen, you'll still get mail and packages and still be able to travel, but national parks could close, and everyday non-essential business with the federal government could also be delayed. Grief counselors will be at hand at a Turlock Middle School today after an eighth grade student was killed by a suspected drunk driver. The 14 year old is being remembered with blue ribbons and sunflowers. The crash happened Friday night near Monta Vista and Gear. Family friends say the teen was riding in a sedan when they were hit by a truck. The driver of that truck, 21 year old Kevin Solis Hernandez of Turlock, faces vehicular homicide charges. West Sacramento police are saying goodbye to one of their own. Senior lead officer Ronaldo Monterosa passed away after a long battle with cancer. He died in South Carolina on vacation. The West Sacramento Police Department says he's being remembered as a proud veteran of the U.S. Army, a loving husband and a father of four. He had been with the department for 11 years. If you'd like to support his family, monetary donations can be dropped off in person during business hours at the front lobby of the West Sacramento Police Station on Jefferson Boulevard. Now for a check of your weather forecast, it's time for that. <laughs> Let's do it. So what we had was some pretty heavy rain yesterday. I know it was on a Sunday and it started pretty early uh, in the late afternoon, early evening, but it's been winding down during the course of the morning and it's not going to last forever. In fact, I see it dwindling down during the morning hours. By the time you get to noon, uh, I think we're pretty much done with this and then we're going to be looking at clearing skies. Now post rain, anytime it's clear overnight with very calm winds, we have to be on the lookout for fog early tomorrow morning. So that is a very real possibility and also it will be slightly breezy. So the next step is to look ahead to the next storm. The only issue there is that I really don't see anything in the pipeline until very late in the week, maybe beginning of next weekend. So we're going to have to just wait for the next big one to come in. Uh, just so you know, record rain in downtown Sacramento over the last 24 hours. So pretty good storm just yesterday.